Good morning, everybody. Uneducated Economist here. So I thought it would be good to talk about board footage pricing and how to um, and how to come up with that retail pricing from board footage. Like, what is how do you how do you translate like board foot future pricing into what I'm paying down here at the retail end when I go down to buy a two by four eight footer? So when they talk about future pricing, they talk about them in board footage. Okay. And generally when you go down to the retail end of things, you're going to be buying by the piece or by the lineal footage. So, um, board footage, a board foot is one inches by 12 inches by 12 inches. However you want to come up with that, whether, you know, as long as it's 144 cubic inches, that's one board foot. So everything is based off of this, this board footage price of 144 cubic inches. Okay. So when somebody says 337 per thousand, they're talking about $337 for every thousand board feet. Okay. And now when you're looking at the future prices and you see that 337 per thousand, what they are talking about is two by four random length standard and better. Okay. It's like the base component for lumber. It's as far as a house goes, it's your stud. It's the stud in the wall. It's like the most common thing out there when you go to a lumber yard, two by four, eight is it. Okay, so the random length two by four is the future pricing. Everything else is kind of like more expensive from there. Okay, generally the 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 price the price per thousand on the bigger lumber starts going up. Takes special cuts. You know the mills don't run nearly as many. You know the it, it's just the, everything goes up from a two by four. Okay, so two by four being the base component for everything. All right. Now, how do we translate this uh, two by four eight into a board footage? Like somebody says, hey, it's gonna cost you, you know, 337 per thousand on your two by four eights. W what does that mean? How, how much is each two by four gonna cost? Okay, first thing we do is we take the eight footer and we translate it over into inches, okay? So now we times two inches by four inches by 96 inches and we come up with 768 inches. Okay, 768 cubic inches, and we divide that by 144, right? So that's simple enough. So we took our two by four, translated it to inches, right? Two by four by 96 comes to what? 768 divided by 144, right? And that equals 5.33. 5.33 board feet per two by four. Eight footer. Okay. So three thirty seven per thousand. So if it costs three hundred and thirty seven per thousand board feet, how much would it be for a hundred board feet? Thirty three seventy. How much for ten board feet? Three dollars and thirty seven cents. How much for one board foot? Thirty three point seven cents. All right. So 33 cents per board foot on a two by four, eight standard and better. Take the 33 cents times it by 5.33, come up with a dollar 79. Okay. Dollar 79, 5.33 times 33 and seven tenths of a cent. Okay. Equals a dollar 79. Take that number and double it. And you should come up with somewhere around what a retail two by four would cost. Okay. And same thing with any other beam or two by material or anything that's a, you know, that's lumber that's priced in per thousand. So like, for example, if you got a six by 12 by, well, let me see, I got my notes here, a six by 12 by 16, convert the 16 over to 192 inches, six times 12 times 192 equals 13,824. If you're priced out at like fourteen hundred per thousand, that's a dollar forty per board foot. All right. So take the thirteen thousand eight hundred and twenty-four divided by one hundred and forty-four. You come up with ninety-six board feet. Ninety-six times one point four, one hundred and thirty-four forty for your beam. So hope that isn't too confusing. I uh, hope that helps. Um, I know certainly uh, when I look at price per thousand, like my mind can like I do it so often now that my mind kind of translates that over to what the retail price end would be just because I'm constantly converting these two over. But that can be a very confusing price because a lot of people look at that 337 per thousand board feet and then not quite 
understand how to relate that to the price per foot that they're paying down there at the retail end. So anyway, I hope that helps out. Uneducated economist, <laughs> you guys let me know.